Okay, so this is the uh, second part of our Let's Create. Well, it's actually the third one I've done because I messed up the first video, but never mind, we won't, we won't talk about that. Um, right, so let's do some lighting. Now, do we have any sort of light fixtures here uh, that we can use? So, OIG, no, it doesn't look like they have added, which is odd. You would think that they would add a light source. Hmm. You know, some kind of bull, you know, something that, um, like a fluorescent light or something. Now let's see if we can, ooh, I don't know what the best thing to do here. So let's go to Google and search for free sci-fi light fbx this sometimes works uh and we want no nope. no uh free strip strip light fbx we can find something free to use. Uh, free strip light, lighting strip, 3D models for download, Turbo Squid. Let's have a look at that. Uh, oh, it has to be free. I'm not paying for anything. Mm. Can't believe we can't get something like that for free. There we go. It's all on sale, but I don't want to pay for it. Okay, so that's ideas out of the window. Um, maybe we should go into Blender and make something. Okay, let's let's do that. What kind of light we should make? That's what I just don't know what we should make. I don't, I, I'm really surprised that this pack doesn't come with some kind of light. Oh, here we go, sci-fi lamp. You know, just as I was saying that, my mouse went onto it. Uh, so here we go. Rotate that, 90. And then we'll place these. Uh, in fact, no, we'll, re we'll have it go on the ceiling. Now, what we want to do, we want to go to the top perspective. And then we can see exactly where we're placing this. Let's just go perspective again. Make sure it's touching the top. Yes, which it is. And then we can go to top. Then I can place this evenly. Uh, so there. Then I'm going to hold in Alt and Shift. Do one there as well. And then Alt and Shift again. Let go and do it again. There. And there. And there. You have to let go of Alt in order to do the next one. Kind of annoying. You can't just keep it held. Okay. Now, what I should have done before I done that was um, actually added the light to it uh, as a blueprint. Probably I should have done that, um, but that's fine. We can just do this instead. So let's find a uh, directional light. We want a spotlight. So put our spotlight onto there. Make sure. Oh, we don't want it there. In the right. Oh, in fact, that's fine because we're going to finish that off in a bit. So, all right, we're at the wrong side. So I'm just going to hold shift, and then I can move along with this camera. Let's move. Okay. So I'm going to set up this light as I want it, and then I'm going to copy it onto all the others. 
So I'm going to turn off snap. Okay, so we'll have it have white light, but we need attenuation radius just to hit the ground, and then we'll turn that on to 20. We want to make it static as well, so we don't have problems when we uh, work with overlapping lights. Let's hit play. It's hard to tell with the, all the other lights shining. In, so we might want to block off this. Um, yeah. Let's see, so. So what if we do 100? Probably better. Like that. Okay, I'm going to leave that like that. And then again, we want to go into top mode. And then. Uh, hold down Alt and Shift, and then we're just doing the same thing. We can just drop these onto the amps. Now they're going to give us our basic lighting, but obviously we want the strobe red lighting as well. So we're going to... I'm not sure what we're going to do next. No, I'm sorry. So then uh, go into perspective. We have all those lights set up nicely. Okay, so actually I do know the next thing we're going to do. We're going to set up the uh, space skybox. So go to content, go to star spheres, and we want probably blueprints, I think. Um, let's delete the sky sphere from this, that, so delete it, and then let's try dragging in this to see what happens. No, <laughs> okay, nice. I did a lot. Hmm. Okay, so... That has actually added a sphere. Now we can see that it's added it. But it's not added a material to it. So that's odd. Even though it says it has a material, I think it's just loading it. Okay, so you can see we're just inside this huge sphere. And that's how our space scene is going to work. Um, let's go to material. Let's go to sphere, materials. And then we should be able to sort of MI star sphere. Uh, MI. Hmm. I've never used this before, so I'm just I'm just figuring it out. Okay, so oh, it just wants to catch up a little bit. Obviously, we don't want the Venus planet surface, uh, planet surface as the space background, but I'm just checking to see if it does actually change. Okay, while we're waiting on that, in fact, I'm just going to do that, and hopefully, it's compiling those shaders. Uh, right, I'm just going to pause the video for a second. I'll be back. Okay, so it did load up eventually. We've got this nice space sky sphere in now instead of the uh, you know the just the bright lights. It's a little bright. I thought I was hoping it was going to be darker, more black, but it doesn't really matter. Uh, when it still still works for us, um, right? And then I guess later on we can add a planet uh, because we've got a. So when we when we uh, have that bit here. We'll place a planet in the background so it's you know front and center. And we also remember going towards a planet, so maybe we won't have one there. We'll see. We'll see. We'll see. Um, right. So hit play. Okay, we can see that lighting now coming into play a little bit more as well. Um, and then 
what have we got? Mobility of game, first person, BP, mark, first person. Oh. Has to be movable if you'd like it to move. No, I don't think that's an important error. I'm not going to worry about that right now. Um, okay, so let's think what's next. Right, so we need to... Um, I really want to get on with that, getting things sucked out into space. I just think that that's going to be fun. So we're, I think what we might do is work on that in the next video because I'm getting a little bit sick of playing around with these models and I want to do some coding. Um, so the last thing I'm going to do, I'm not going to bother building the lighting actually until I um, have everything enclosed. Um, right, we'll leave this one here and in the next one we'll try and get some stuff to get sucked out into space. I'm not going to, like that. I, I don't know how I'm going to do that. Uh, but we'll figure that out. Okay, I'll see you in the next one.